Miller is out there with LaMelo Ball. And it's Mitchell. And it's Williams at the center. And for Memphis. In at the guard spots. Morant and Bain. Wiggins is out there with Hardy. It is still early in the season, Greg. We'd, we'd like to think we have teams figured out, but but do we really? Not at all, Kevin. This is the time period where fan bases freak out because of records. There's still a lot of identity to be found with every... Williams has a screen for Mitchell. And he drew the pucking foul. He'll go to the line for two. Great for a franchise like Memphis. Is there a specific way they have to build? Through the draft. I, I mean... Free throw drops for Mitchell. And Mitchell drops some both. Miller, the pass to Mitchell. And he goes big with the cup right over John Morant. And guys, that's not as easy as he made it look. You've got to have some skills to pull that off. Well, he's got Miller outside. He kicks it to ball. Charlotte moving the ball around. And you cannot leave anybody open on ball's team because this guy is excellent at finding. Passes to Miller. Miller outside, a three ball. Good for the basket, starting off one for one with that. Mitchell looking it over. Loads it up for Williams, hammers the alley-oop through. And how about the communication between teammates on that alley-oop? And that's what you need to pull that thing off. Ball against Morant to the inside. And then Mitchell at the dunk. The finish was nice, but the setup was better. Yeah, G.A., the pick working to full of help from the defense there to compensate. He gets a clean look, and that's exactly how you draw it up. Here's Morant. After the basket by Charlotte. Shoots over ball, and it's sent back by Mitchell. Kicks the ball. Wiggins against Mitchell. Down low, Mitchell, and a great assist by Miller as that one goes in. Really played well against Portland in his last out. Williams with the block. To the middle, here's Mitchell, and it's Mitchell with the jam. You know, passes like that goal. Try to put that one behind him. Yeah, lots of sloppy play in that one. Several key miscues that they just couldn't overcome the mistakes. But you know you got to take care of the basketball. Hopefully they learn. Memphis has gone four of eight out of three point attempts doing a lot of work from way outside here in the first quarter. And we're going to have a jump ball. It's tied up there. Williams has got his fourth rebound with that last one here tonight. To the inside, Mitchell, and it's Mitchell at the jam. You gotta love his aggressiveness to finish inside. Well, his leaping ability. Connect. And you know, guys, always a tough catch on the lob. Placement and timing have to be close to perfect. Now here is Miller. He's got eight, and there is Miller. Good that time on the assist from Miller. Outside ball. Back to Mitchell. And then Mitchell at the dunk. Excellent all-around performance so far. Hence the big lead. Yeah, you know, they've had the advantage of both from him. The last game against the Wizards in Washington. Just five on the clock. Loads it up for Williams. And it's Williams finishing it off. Well, part of their game plan was to block out the noise and just stay focused. And what's game? Increased production across the board? I think it's just a matter of time with this guy. Now, here is Miller. Eight points for him. Displaying intensity right off the opening tip, especially on the offensive end. Morant threaded the needle there. Just an excellent pass off that pick. To the paint. And it's Mitchell with the jam. Hey, what's going on? Of this game, but doing it with a...
fifth rebound right now in the game. He's cooled down a little bit after draining those two three-pointers in the first quarter. Now, here's Mark, and it's Mitchell with the jam. And one step ahead of the D to put a lot of pressure on the interior defenders with their work down low. Outside, Payne. Back to Morant. Misses from short range. The period. Their work from beyond the arc has been to highlight a lot of threes, finding the bottom of the bucket. We'll get right back to the action when we return. Now taking a closer look at the first half, how about the performance from these two guys? These two stepped up to the plate. They're carrying their teams offensively, though they are getting some help, but there's an individual battle going on as well. And oh. Cross contact on the shot, and now a three-point play chance as he'll head to the line. Yep, and an opportunity for one more at the line. Wiggins with the toughness to finish through contact. And he's got his first chance at the line here. And foul on the shot. He'll shoot two at the free throw line. Yeah, easy call. Yeah, you can hear the smack all the way over here where we are. Charlotte shooting their sixth. And comparing to the numbers of last season, they've made a bit of improvement. So that's some positive momentum they can look to build on. First free throw is good. He'll drop some both. Just fanning the flame. Yeah, I love the fact he doesn't play the score. He just keeps coming. Attack mode. He doesn't know how to step off the gas pedal. The rugged toughness of Moran. Excellent at fighting through there. Into the third we go. Two minutes in now. Miller sets a screen for Mitchell. Oh, and then the alley -oop. And Miller throws it down hard. Oh, and the lead gets bigger on a ridiculous offensive sequence. That Miller. No good. A slight advantage for them in the rebound department, but that oftentimes is all it takes. Especially when you're scoring the ball at a decent clip the way they have. I mean, they've done I'm the wing Mitchell. Floats it up for Williams. Throws down the alley oop slam. And you can see him give a little nod and then just burst to the rim. The weak coverage play. to the paint. Here's Akio. And it's sent back by Mitchell. And it's out of bounds. Nice touch by Mitchell. No, oh, Kevin. 78% conversion rate from the free throw line. So that's a nice all-around effort. You know, their percentage has dropped off just a little bit compared to last year, guys. But it's not a huge drop-off, so no major concern. Nice timing on the alley. Four-point game. Good deal. shooting eight of fifteen. Ball against Morant. Here's Mitchell. Count that one. Now it's a six-point Hornets. Ten of their last twelve coming off assists. Ball against Morant. Inside stolen by Ball. Here's Mitchell, and he goes big with the tap right over John Morant. We tend to focus on what the mellow ball gives you offensively, but he's disruptive defensively, too. Awesome rewind, courtesy of the AT&T 5G Slam Camp. Washington sets the pick for Mitchell. There's the lob to the hoop. Boy, nice job that time by P.J. Washington to knock down the shot after setting the screen. Kicks it out to Mitchell. Washington with a screen on Bain. Down to five on the shot clock. And Mitchell gets it. Outside ball. The pass to Green. To the wing on the left. A shot by Washington, and he's wide open. And a great assist here. 
in the second despite being down. That's exactly when you need to be aggressive. You know that. I mean, another good job though, of drawing contact and getting to the free throw line. That is not possible. What we just, <laughs> is, is that possible? You know, he should be getting extra attention from the defense, not less. And a lot of contact on that one, so he'll shoot two here. He's second team. Bill and have taken control on the glass. Green with a screen for Mitchell. Bobbed up there for Green. He takes the alley oop pass and dunks it down. Oh, phenomenal alley oop slam there. They are taking advantage of a team that looks low in this game. Mitchell finds Miller. Back to Mitchell. And it's Mitchell with the jam. Now flying high and throwing it down with the one hand Woo, one of his with a screen on Wiggins shot clock at six and foul on the shot so he'll get a chance at the line first one falls for him. Mitchell drops them both. And, and you can see the confidence. Yeah, I'd be confident too. As a matter of fact, I mean, if you're stacking up threes the way he is, I mean, he's doing all his work from behind the arc. I mean, even from over here, you can see that. The first free throw is good. Good on both. Most pro sports don't have this kind of stability. Boy, he'd sure like to have that this back. Hard to chip away at a lead when you're leading freebies at the line. And this is what they wanted. I mean, too well this season. Always nice to get a win in that first battle. They'll go up 1-0 in the season series against the Grizzlies. And we watched one guy all night long, guys. And look at the stats. Just can and so it's the Hornets taking care of business in this one. They came in here and took care of business like they were the home team. And Kevin, how about the mental toughness that this group showed? They, they...